Hello everyone, this is me, Savia here, and I'm back with the third week of June reads, start from the 15th through the 21st of June, 2024. This reading is going to be for the sign of Cancer. So Cancerians, let's see what's coming in for you for this week time. Just be mindful, it's a general read. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see, Cancer, what is coming through for you for this week time? What can you expect coming for you for this week time? Cancer, we do have the new contact and silence. For some of you, you might be in a new contact situation with someone specific during this week time. Or maybe somebody is giving you silent treatment right now um and you're not like happy about it for some of you you might be the one giving silent treatment to someone out there um let's see more here what's coming through for cancerians for this week time i feel like you know for some of you you might be feeling very lonely and um you don't have someone specific in your love life which is definitely making you feel like really really sad and unhappy uh about your current situation in love um we do have the legal matter and disputes um for some of you maybe there is somebody out there who is stuck in legal matter or disputes right now um and they are not talking to you maybe you're unaware of whatever that they are personally dealing with but yes there might be like they might be stuck with something toxic in their personal life and uh, maybe they have ghosted you or they haven't been able to talk to you because of the legal matter that they got themselves into uh, regarding the third party for some of you um if you are in a toxic marriage or a relationship you might be parting ways if your person is in a toxic marriage or relationship they might be parting ways and they're currently dealing with that drama and they are going to come back to you we do have the twin flame here but yes i really feel like you know cancerians for a majority of you if you are dealing with someone specific who has a third party involved they are dealing with an ending of that third party and i really feel like you know, they are definitely going to be coming back to you because um this person really believes that you are the soulmate for them and uh, in current situation uh, maybe they have a lot to get done with when it comes to the person that they are currently with um right now maybe you are heartbroken you are feeling like oh nothing is going to ever work out for you in your life but things are going to change you and this person are going to come back together so there will be reconciliation taking place meanwhile you just need to release the stress that you are taking and try to heal your heart um the person who is right now uh currently not in touch with you i really feel like you know they are definitely going to come back to you um there is a third party involvement here which could be influencing your love life in a negative way right now but it is going to come to an end and the two of you will be able to come back together you and this person are definitely either twin flame or a soulmate and the two of you are about to be together so the justice is going to come through again i feel for some of you um uh, maybe the third inter uh, the third party interference has influenced your love life in a very negative way and in this week time as well yes there will be some things that happening which which is going to make you feel like you know you're you're blocked you're tied to a situation you don't know where to go what to do but just keep patience and um uh, things going to start working well for you. I really feel like you know, this week is the time when you have to heal your heart and try to release the tension that you are taking around it because I really don't think that the communication is going to come through for you during this week time, but eventually it will. And the person that you're dealing with, you will have a new beginning with that specific someone. Um, let's see some more cards here. What else is coming through for you for this uh, week time? What else is coming through for you for this week time, Cancerians? Um... Two on one. I really feel like you know the third party influence is definitely very strong here. But just know one thing that this is gonna be a perfect week for you when it comes to your career finance. And um all you have to do is take care of yourself and try not to get too much stress around something happening or something not working for you in your love life right now. For majority of you, I really feel like you know this is gonna be a very busy and occupied week, but you will be stressed out because of the you know love life situation you would feel lonely you would feel like you know lack of having someone specific in your life and you're waiting for them to return you're waiting for them to reach out but um it's gonna take time i really feel like you just have to keep yourself strong um it's better if you could uh, focus on your other areas of your life right now rather than keeping um you know 
dab on this person when are they going to reach out and stuff like that try to keep yourself chill out uh just know that whatever that is happening right now is definitely going to get you something more than what you're asking for uh try to look at the positive and even in the current situation when you're feeling like you know nothing is working well for you uh try to dream or daydream about the good things that you want to manifest for yourself um i really feel like you know for majority of you um this person um I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, this person that you're currently dealing with, uh, this person definitely has a third body here. There is an influence of a third body in, you know, here so strong that, you know, that is definitely blocking your love life right now. But um, just know that everything is going to be okay. Um, I really see people talking crap about you and your relationship with this person. Um, maybe because uh, this person, whoever it is that you are dealing with, maybe they are, you know, married or taken. Uh, but you are dating someone who's married is what i see here or who is like you know dealing with a toxic relationship in their personal life but you are taking a lot of stress here as if like you know you don't know what's going to happen next uh but just know one thing that this person whoever it is that you're dealing with whoever it is that you're waiting for they are definitely going to come back and they will be wanting a new beginning with you so let's see some messages coming from this person i feel like you know they will be coming to see your parents just to just to uh, you know cement this relationship with you they will be reaching out to you soon um but this week is not the time when you're gonna see this person reaching out to you to be honest you will have to be patient my life started when i met you i feel like you know, this person really believes that you know their life has been toxic before the two of you came together um you know you entering in their life has changed things for good you have uh, so many choices and options. This person really knows that you are somebody who probably would be a dream of anyone. And they know that you have many choices and options, but still you are choosing to stick on them. That's something definitely they admire about you. You are right. And this person really wants you to know they are ready and they are preparing themselves up for for this, uh, you know, uh, this connection. And that's why they're trying to get rid of the third body here. Uh, and then so they could take action towards you. This is what they want you to know. Let's see some more cards here. What else is the guidance for you for this week time? We do have music for manifesting. To manifest rapidly, think of your desire while you chant, hum, sing, or play music. So manifesting whatever you want with this person is never going to be easier than just manifesting them using affirmations, subliminals, and all those mantras and chants. And I feel like you know that can work out so perfectly for you during this week time as well. So if you need my assistance and want to purchase affirmations from me, you can do that. But you can also make your own affirmations and chant them as much as you can to, to manifest uh, what you want quicker by focusing on what you desire more than anything else. So yeah, that's what I see coming through for you for this week time. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care. Bye.